Hello collective and welcome back to another love reading. I hope you've been well. Let's see what's going on for the collective in love. Let's get a message for the collective. Spirit, please give me a message for the collective. What's going on with the collective in love, please? Give me a message, Spirit. We have let the past go. Can we rewind time and go back to before we were both broken down by life? Our past hold us back from our future. Wow. You have someone in your energy who has been holding on to past pain and has really been reluctant to let it go you know this could be your energy as well maybe you are holding on to past pain and you're holding back from maybe a new connection but i feel like the past has a great influence on your current situation we have my fantasy you're my fantasy. I have pictures and videos saved of you and use them for inspiration. I want you. You definitely have someone in your energy who totally fantasizes. I feel like this person, you are constantly on their mind. They can't stop thinking about you. And it could be that you have sent pictures or if you have social media, they could be viewing pictures or videos and constantly viewing you, right? <laughs> and definitely maybe using that for some kind of inspiration, if you know what I mean, right? Okay? But you're definitely on someone's mind. We have lost. I feel lost without you. Yeah, exactly what I said. This person thinks about you. I feel like you're constantly on someone's mind. You you haven't left them. This could be someone from your past. This could be someone that you've just met or just about to meet. But I feel like you have left a lasting impression on this person. And now that you're not in their energy or even if there's just a slight distance i feel like this person feels very lost without you they feel very alone give me the next message please spirit give me the next message you're so mysterious wow I can never seem to figure you out. Sometimes I feel like you're hiding something from me. Never really know where I stand with you. And I feel like this person, this person in your, in your energy finds you very mysteri mysterious. They can't seem to figure you out. But I feel like you're coming across as, to this person as very authentic, very real, right? And I feel like that's the mystery about it. You come across to this person in a way that is so authentic that it's unique. It's very rare. I feel like you're coming across to this person not really hiding anything and that's leaving a sense of mystery as to where you come from what you're about if you're really real right we have focused on money I feel like your person has been focused on their career focused on things of the material nature for a very long time and 
I feel like that has been their focus. That has been their way of feeling successful is focusing on their money. And I, I feel like your person is really trying to keep that focus, right? But we have these fantasies right above that. And I feel like they're not able to keep their focus the way they normally would. And that's leaving them feeling like they're not sure where this is going to go. Wow. Yeah, feeling lost. We have lost up here. I feel lost without you. And then we have feeling lost again. This person feels very lost without you. That's the reason why they're losing their focus on what normally d distracts them. That goes back to this mystery of you, right? And I feel like your person is feeling so lost. They're trying to to make what is normal for them work right and what's normal for them is focusing on their money their career their distractions their hobbies you know and they're not able to do that and because of that this person <laughs> is feeling very distracted distracted by the thoughts of you because they can't stop thinking about you you're living in their in their head rent free you know and they're trying to do their normal routine and it's not it doesn't work so that leaves this mystery about you as to how or why you have come into their life at this point of, of time you know I, I feel like they kind of feel like this is not the right time for this to be happening you know um i feel a lot of tension when it comes to this masculine oh wow you're my favorite you're the person i want to call when something good or bad happens the first thought when I have news to share, you're my person. This person, yeah, he's he's realizing. He's realizing that you are someone very special. We also have attached to my ex. Wow. Okay. I feel like that has to do with this past situation. It could be a lot of pain that this masculine is holding on to from past situations. Or it could be a current situation to where there's an, ener an energy in this masculine's field that he's trying to figure out how to maneuver, you know? Um, I feel like this masculine is a, attached to things that have happened to them emotionally, physically, or even as deep as spiritually when it comes to past situations. And that has created a big fear for this masculine. E even though this masculine has so much love, they can't get you off their mind. There's this fear that holds them back. We're going to get one more card. Tears. Okay, when I think about you, I cry. And I'm not sure you're, if you're aware of it or not, but this masculine feels a lot of emotions when it comes to your connection and if you're connected to this masculine on a soul level I feel like you have felt this as well I feel like you have felt the emotions the emotional tug on your heart on your soul when it comes to this masculine especially when they are feeling overwhelmed or emotional 
I feel like you can feel that connection so deeply. But I'm not a, I'm not sure if maybe you are aware that this masculine cries over you. They they cry about this connection. Finding myself. Yeah, I feel like this masculine is really diving deep within themselves to find themselves. Because they're trying to figure out how to go about your connection. How to figure it out. And how to get out of certain situations that they're in. I feel like this masculine is very overwhelmed. But they're trying to figure out their, their situation. We have you hurt me. Everything that happened hurt me so much. I need more time to heal. This masculine is definitely healing. And I feel like if, if it was you that hurt this masculine in some way. Maybe with something that you said to him. Maybe something that you called him out on. Um, I feel like it, it really dove deep into this masculine and it kind of made them think made them kind of go within when it comes to this masculine but whatever you said whatever you did really hit hard really you know even if they didn't show it to you I feel like once this masculine was alone or took time out for themselves, I feel like they let these emotions out. And it, it really, really hurt them. This could also be being hurt from past events when it comes to this masculine. Because this masculine, I feel like has been hurt a lot i feel like this masculine has been in situations that you have no idea what they had to do in order to get out of you know i feel like this masculine really has seen a lot of loss and a lot of heartbreak not to say that you haven't but i, I feel like this masculine feels like Everything they touch is ruined, you know? Um, a lot of five of cups energy. And we have the Knight of Swords. I'm going to pull one more card. Um, we have the Knight of Swords. So I feel like this masculine really wants to come to you to talk. They may, might want to come to you to let you know what's going on in their life. How they're feeling. Um, but I feel like this masculine is bringing you some sort of truth. And this Knight of Swords, this is fast moving energy. So this is something that will probably happen in the very near future. Um, a lot of truth. We have the Two of Wands. Yeah, like I said, the very near future. This is something that, that's going to happen soon. Um, with the Two of Wands. One more. The high priestess yeah secrets are gonna come out definitely judgment at the bottom I feel like this masculine is gonna bring you a lot of truth they're gonna come to you and let you know what's going on in their life um, but I feel like this masculine as far as your connection I feel like you know there's a type of trust and security that you've created in your connection this masculine feels at home in your energy so I feel like this masculine knows that they're safe speaking their mind to you um, they're just afraid to do it because they're afraid that they're not in the right place in their life to be everything that you need you know but I feel like this masculine is going to gonna let you know a lot of the secrets 
a lot of the things that they've been holding on to very intense very emotional things hmm. that's what I have for you if this resonates please like and subscribe hit that bell and until the next time many blessings love and light